Hey guys, Jordi here from Yepper Design and welcome to another great Premiere Pro tutorial. Uh, I'm about to remake an old tutorial of me, which is the Hype Williams effect. Hype Williams is a film director, uh, especially known in the music industry where, where he makes uh, music videos. Um, so let me just show you. This is the effect. Uh, this is some raw footage of a music clip we're working on at the moment. Okay, pretty awesome. Uh, and let's get star started with it. I'm going to create a new sequence, press OK, and I'm going to drag my source video into ch video channel 1 and onto video channel 2, so we have duplicated. Uh, the first thing we want to do is take the crop effect, which is under transform crop, and put it on the uh, video channel 2, the, the top layer. Uh, we want to toggle off the first video layer, so we can see the effects. Uh, if we go to crop, open it up, and video effects, uh, the uh, top, we want to crop it 30% and the bottom also 30%. If you want to have it more or, or less, that's fully up to you. Okay, uh, wh what we want to do now is uh, toggle the video channel uh, 1 back on, select it, go to motion and scale it up, up to um, 150 percentage. Okay, um, you can change the position if you want, or you can scale it even more. That's, again, fully up to you. Uh, the next thing we want to do is change some colors. So we go to color and search after the color correction, the three-way color corrector, which is right here, and drag it onto your first video layer. Uh, we're going to toggle off the one above so we can see the uh, video channel one uh, fully. We're going to open up the three-way color tractor and we can see three wheels here. The first one is for the black colors, uh, this one is for the mid colors, the, the middle colors, the gray tones, and this one here is for the white or the highlights. And we're going to give it uh, some blue color, so give it all blue colors. And we can change the saturation, we can give it some more saturation, like that. This looks pretty awesome. You can go wild and crazy on it. Uh, also, if you want to give it a black, uh, sorry, if you want to give it uh, red or green colors, then that's again fully up to you. Okay, uh, I have selected highlights. So what we're going to do at the, uh, if you scroll down, you can see input and output levels here. We're going to give it some more contrast and we can do this in the input levels. So I'm going to change the whites if I uh, move this one up in the middle one to there. I just move it all the way to, to, to the left, so like that. So we have the white tones. We've got harder white tones, harder um, highlights. Then go to the shadows, and we're going to give it some more deep black color. So go to the blacks, as you can see. Okay, you know, this looks pretty awesome. Um, toggle back on your first video layer and render it out by pressing, by pressing enter. And play the video. And this effect looks pretty awesome, as you can see. Uh, okay, uh, thank you for watching, and I hope you learned something out of this tutorial. Don't forget to check out my website, which is uh, www.yepperdesign.com, which is also in the description. Uh, leave a comment, I really like comments, especially when they're positive. Uh, well, goodbye.